giving you a voice. Making it loud our own way. Welcome, Welcome to the fun. fun. Our next presenter is John Hirschdick. Uh, John is a CAD software developer and the co-founder of Onshape, as I mentioned earlier. He's also the founder and former CEO of SolidWorks, uh, which many of you I'm sure are familiar with. So I gotta say, uh, John is one of the coolest people I know. The more I get to know him, just the more impressed I am with all the cool things he's done and uh, just all the difference he's making in the world in terms of these different products and uh, you know things that are available to you as you're building robots and you're kind of designing the future. Um, you've probably tried SolidWorks before and now you've used Onshape and John is one of the masterminds behind both of them. So it's pretty great to have him here. Uh, he comes out of MIT and is yet another legend in the world of CAD, a thought leader, and he's definitely an innovator. And that's why we've asked him to present the next distinguished award, which is the Woody Flowers Award for Most Unique Design. The winner of this award will also receive $500 as a prize. And I'll let John tell you a little bit more about it. Well, thank you very much, Alyssa. And I want to first say um, thank you to all of you. The work you've done is so inspiring to all of us and so gratifying, not only in your use of Onshape and not only in your creation of, of incredibly professional, thoughtful work, all of you, but also in the determination and resourcefulness and, and uh, improvisational skills you showed doing this work during this COVID crisis. And, uh, our, our hearts go out to all you and your families and your friends, and I hope that you're all doing as well as possible during this situation. But your work, you know, we're, we're supposed to come here and inspire you, but it's you who have inspired us with your work. So it's a great honor to be here in general, but particularly to be able to speak about one of my all-time mentors and great teachers in, who influenced my life, Professor Woody Flowers. Woody um, was a professor at MIT, and I actually took his class in 1981. Um, what was called the 270 class, which was remarkably like a first competition before there was first. Woody um, taught us so much about how to think about design and creativity and human needs and practically building things and uh, just communications more than I could even, um, a spirit of friendly competition and how to promote ideas and drive people to do their best. And like I say, I'm tremendously honored uh, to remember him. It was a shock when he passed away last year. Co-founding first, one of just many things he did that was fantastic in his life. I actually wanted to also share that um, this is the Woody, the picture there, as you may have known him. Here's a picture that I found as I remember him in the, the 80s there. There he is in his white suit. And, uh, and this is at the 1981 MIT 270 design competition. And I actually went down to the basement and dug out my own machine that I built in this class. And here it is. Oh, wait, let me turn off the background just a moment. I actually kept my machine. This class was such a profound made such a profound impact on me and I worked so hard building the machine. I learned so much. I could never quite bring myself to throw it away. And so I've saved this since 1981. Here's my machine that I built um, in Woody's class, uh, 270 at MIT. It was um, a competition to put a round peg in a square hole. And uh, it, it was a wonderful, wonderful class. So in, in Woody's memory, um, we present now the the um, the award, the Woody Flowers Most Unique Design Award. Um, this is for a design that captures innovative mindset and spirit of Woody, a unique a robot that takes a unique approach and solves a world real world problem with intelligent design. And I have to say, this was a very very difficult choice that uh, the judges the judges worked on um, with me. And uh, the winner is drum roll <laughs> the Kathari robot from Big Red Robotics, uh, FTC number 11166. Uh, we, we chose this award because it used, like many robots, thought about a sanitization theme. We loved the way it had a dual function going toward the floor and up above. It was not the most complicated robot, but complication doesn't always mean a more innovative design. And it looked very realistically buildable, which I think Woody would have liked. I think he also would have liked the attention to a bit of styling and appearance as well. 
And again, this is a very, very tough decision, but hats off to Big Red Robotics and what we think was a great, a great innovative design. Woody would be proud and so are all of us. Great, thank you, John. And congratulations team 11166 Big Red Robotics. Uh, super impressive design and as John said, very clean and slick and very unique. Uh, in the whole scheme of you know all the submissions. Um, remember, if you're just joining, be sure to type in exclamation PTC in the chat uh, to be sure to get up to speed. The Robots to the Rescue Challenge on First Updates Now is brought to you by PTC. Don't forget that you can register for Onshape for free and start designing right in your browser at onshape.com forward slash education dash plan.